Turning up the lights, admiring the view. That's all. How long have you been trapped up there? I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning, Fox. I am at work. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. It's on spring break. So, I'm at the grocery store. Bam. And Little Cup and I are going to go grocery shopping. So, Heidi has a chance to uh, film some of her videos. Normally, Little Cup goes to um, Chloe's place. But uh, that's not, that's not going to be a good idea today because she is sick. So... We're gonna go expose the general populace of germs instead of our friends. We're at the grocery store, we're getting our stuff here. And strawberries are on sale, so we're gonna get strawberries. Oh, what are you doing? Goodness, I look away for one second, this is what happens. Yeah, yeah, you gotta know, oh, here. Let's clean up here. Yeah, there we go. See, Papa's prepared. He somehow had the preemptive intuition that he was gonna need napkins. I don't know how he knew that. He must be psychic. So. Yep, that goes on here. Thank you for helping. rosalyn has got her one orange, because that's very important to her apparently. We were riding past it and she was like, oh, oh. actually she's like, apple, apple, and I'm like, no, that's an orange, but I understand what you mean. Isn't that right? You excited with your orange? Yes, you look like you're plotting something. <laughs> oh, uh oh. Ah, there it goes. Oh, feel the power, little cub. Can you feel it? Our moment of triumph approaches. It's dinner time. Da -da -da. Oh, okay. <laughs> Did you just lick your orange? Did you just take a bite of your orange? <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> So side note, Fox, I'm here looking at olive oil, and I want to point something out to some of you, a little life hack, if you will, that you guys may not know. Have you ever gone to the olive oil section and you notice that there's different kinds? And so there's the extra virgin, and there's extra light, and there's all these different kinds, and you're like, why are there so many different kinds? And you probably have heard, like, Rachel Ray go EVO, right? Extra virgin olive oil, or cooks, so they get extra virgin olive oil. Here's the thing with extra virgin olive oil, is that it's very, very flavorful. And since it's very flavorful, there, there's the olive oil taste. And if you want that, that's great. But if you're not looking for an olive oil taste, uh-oh. If you're not looking for an olive oil taste, you're, lo you're looking to cook something, like maybe fry something that you don't want it tasting like olive oil at all, what you're gonna wanna get is this. The extra light. See, extra light, okay. Um, or like right here, extra light. And the reason we want the extra light is because it is an oil, it's still olive oil, but it will not have that extra olive oil flavor. And so you can cook things and it won't transfer that flavor very well. It's much closer to um, vegetable oil, which is probably what some of you are using it for. Um, and then you get that wonky taste. So the more you know. Oh no, okay. Little cub, you spilled like four drops of my coffee. <laughs> can you apologize? Say sorry. Can you say sorry? No? Silence. Little cub, say sorry please. Can you say sorry? Yes. Okay, thank you, I forgive you. Okay, please don't spill my coffee. Little cub had a bit of a freak out with the milk. And so I was like, oh, what are we gonna do? Well, there's a Starbucks here inside the facilities. And so she has her own little cup of milk. You can drink from this one, that's okay. There's just milk in there. That's milk, that's a cup of milk. We need cheese, come on. Let's go. Little cub, you got your own broom? Got it from Lily's. Yeah. You excited about your broom? You sweeping? Notice the dogs are over here like, um, this is exciting but terrifying at the same time. Calypso they didn't, they didn't know the story because we didn't film it yesterday. Oh yeah, so yesterday we are letting little cub play with the big broom, which is a bit much for her to handle. And then she smacked Calypso, and we're like, whoa, no, you can't do that. And we took the broom away, and she got very upset. She had to melt, she had to melt like, 
Chernobyl level meltdown for like an hour just screaming about the broom and would not let it go. Like, let, why don't you play with your tools? Why don't you do this? Why don't you do that? And she was just like, no, broom, broom, and kept running to the, the, the hall closet where the broom was. Anyways, so I got her a small room. What do we do with the broom? No, we don't, we don't sweep Papa, we sweep the floor. Stop, can you stop sweeping my shoes? Yep. Can we not sweep me? We don't sweep me. Yeah, okay. Please sweep the floor here. Thank you. We don't sweep people, we sweep the floor. She's fanning. This, this, yeah. It's much easier to handle, right, little cub? I can tell that you're trying to sweep me and not smack me. <laughs> Anyways, the dogs are like, um, why would you give her, okay, she's like, what is the matter with you? Why would you give her a small one? Hi, this is called kimchi, okay? It is, I just gagged a little bit. Um, this is, it's pickled cabbage and radish and other things, and it's a Korean dish, and it's delicious, and I get it every now and then. Heidi hates it, because it smells, it's very pungent smelling. Um, so, the way you deal with that is you bag it three times. <laughs> and it's still barely enough. We used to keep it in our backyard. Yeah. Hey Bucks, you wanna know a trick to uh, boiling water really fast if you got a lot of water you need to boil? Use two pans. Boom. Boils twice as fast. Little cup is hungry. We're gonna feed her now. Today has been a really nice day and I've barely been on the vlog at all. I did film videos for the Hide K Makeup channel and the Hide Kim TV channel. Apollo is very upset because uh, Daddy and Roslyn just went to check the mail. That's such a weird sound that you make. Anyway, I'll let them outside. Um, I did film videos for both my other channels, so those should be up this week. Assuming I can get them all edited. I got two edited today so far. Calypso! Um, so that is exciting, and it has been so nice having Ken back home. Basically, what he's done today is play video games, but even just, like, having him here so I can do things like just walk out of the house to take the garbage out without having to bring Rosalind with me or walk to the laundry room has really, really helped me kind of get things picked up, which is what I've been doing pretty much all day. All day, almost. Um, I did swing by the P.O. Box, and I also picked up some wipes that I needed, um, and Ken went grocery shopping, but I think he filmed that, so I think you already saw that. <laughs> and yeah, now I'm, I'm cleaning while they go for a walk. There's a bee here, and he is very confused. He's just hovering around my sledgehammer, and I think, he's, I think that he thinks it's a flower. And as I'm out here in the back, and I am finally getting rid of this thing. It's been sitting out here for a while, and um, I was going to take care of it last week, but I got busy because it was last week, and um, I didn't get a chance to. I need to chop it up into small pieces so it can go into the trash. That's another bee. There's a lot of bees around. And I'm done. There you go. Nice little bricks. It's kind of a shame that... Uh, the dogs peed on it, and we didn't just decide to retire it because, you know, it's got some discoloration, but that's that's kind of normal. What? But the inside, this interior part, looks, you know, it's generally good, but um, well, several of these are covered in dog urine um, just from, you know, before, you know, we put it out here. And now after being out here, it's, uh, it's just gotten worse. So I'm going to throw these in the garbage, and then I've got my little workshop area over there. I came out to call Kenan from dinner, and he was just like I'm standing just up here, nailing admire, stuff. Yeah, I'm just nailing up the lights, admiring the view. That's all. How long have you been trapped up there? About 10 minutes. Every time I try and get down, it swivels, and I almost fall and crack my skull open. He's just like, <laughs> I need help, and I was like, okay, let me get the camera and film it first. You're a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> now, hold it. You giving baby a piggyback ride? Again, more. Do it again. Oh my gosh, okay. Babies don't generally bend that way. <laughs> no, that's a doll. She wants to watch old, old videos, guys. So that's, wow, I'm making a really cute face there. That's Roslyn's seven week update. Look at tiny Roslyn. 
We've also been watching a lot of the old adventures of Ken and Little Club. Little Club? <laughs> little Cub. Yeah, there's a baby. That's you, Little Cub. Do you guys want to see that? I'll link that playlist down below. That's like our daily vlogging before we started daily vlogging back on the other channel. And you were itty bitty. But she just wants to watch the baby. And mommy's scary face. Mom. Hope you guys enjoyed watching today's vlog. I enjoyed being me because I am on spring break and it was awesome. Um, and I enjoyed spending time with Little Cup today. Hope you guys enjoyed the adventure. If you did, give us a thumbs up down below. If you have not yet hit the subscribe button, you should do so because we do videos on this channel every single day. And there should be a new video live on the Heidi Kim TV channel. Why are you raising your hands? Also, also, I'm a little bit bored. So leave comments down below so I can respond to them. I don't really care what they're about. Just ask me a question. Ask me any question you want. Anything. Okay. I'll answer anything from like what size shoe I wear to, okay, not anything. But just something to keep me, you know, entertained, please. So, Ken will be answering tomorrow's comments. Yes. So, if you, have, if you have something you want to question or ask, go ahead and leave that comment down below. And I will be taking care of that tomorrow. Bye, guys. She had a whole meltdown over the broom. <laughs> yeah. And it's like when she gets sick, it's like she loses all ability to communicate at all. So, like, she wanted to eat, but was so frustrated that we did not know what she wanted to eat. And she wouldn't